October 16, 1943 is ingrained in Italy's history as a day of clear and direct anti-Semitism. It's the day when Nazi soldiers evacuated Jews from the Roman ghetto. And now, new details show how Pius XII helped Jews in Rome before the events of the so-called Black Saturday, even before the arrival of the Nazis to the Eternal City. By July 9th, the monastery was already taken in use, and on July the 20th, a letter from the diocese arrived. It read, this is papal territory, please do not enter. And this happened seven weeks before the German occupation of Rome. In all, 43 monasteries opened their doors to Rome's Jewish population before the occupation. And these very details were discussed during a conference on Pius XII at Rome's Pontifical Lateran University. And help continued even after the German army occupied Rome. After the occupation of Italy, the Jewish population of Rome increased. On June the 4th, 1944, there were about 9,930, out of which 60 hundred received help. That's almost two-thirds. In a three-part investigation, this Belgian researcher looked into all the details of the dark chapter in history, from the name of each Jewish person to where they hid and for how long. This specific information was introduced publicly for the first time, and it could change the perception of the role Pope Pius XII played during World War II.